the Radiation Protection Authority of Zimbabwe's mandate is to ensure the protection of the people and the environment against the harmful effects of radiation. And one of the uh, long-term effects of exposure uh, to radiation is the incidence of cancer. And as you may be aware, today is the World Cancer Day, uh, Commemoration Day. And uh, Paranormal Group of Hospitals has got uh, a radiotherapy center uh, where cancer treatment um, takes place using radiation um, technologies, something that is uh, regulated um, by RPAZ. So we saw it fit to join uh, the hospital in the cleanup campaign to raise awareness uh, over care uh, for uh, pa pa patients of cancer. In, in Zimbabwe, we've got three centers uh, that do cancer treatment, a perennial one, Mpilo, uh, and a private one. Uh, so perennial is not the only one, but we just chose uh, due to the proximity to our premises, perennial. Uh, the, the use of radiation technologies is um, widespread. Uh, from um, agricultural production, uh, veterinary diagnostics, uh, industry process automation, uh, even in um, the mining industry, as well as for security uh, at uh, ports of entry and uh, private uh, company premises. So we've got quite a varied um, base of uh, stakeholders. A regulatory framework uh, which we implement as RPAZ is to ensure that uh, people um, are, are not unnecessarily exposed to radiation uh, so that we reduce the probability of uh, getting cancers coming from radiation exposure. So we do uh, regulate the use of radiation. Anyone who has to use radiation in the country has to be licensed.